Hi guys, my name is Tinash and welcome back to my channel. It is always, always a pleasure to have you guys on board. So today what we have is a shopping vlog. Uh, we're going to do some uh, shopping today. So I know some of you guys requested that I do some, at least I incorporate some vlog style uh, shopping vlogs. So today that's what we're going to do. I am just finishing up on my list. I have a list here as you can see. So I'm just writing things down that we need. Um, yeah, forgive this room, we are still yeah sprucing it up but um for what we want to do it's okay so yeah just wrote a few things that we need and i'm just uh, updating that so that at least when we go to the supermarket we are not so much off track so yeah uh join us today as we do this if i'm able to film in the supermarket etc i'll do that or wherever it is that we're going uh we have an agenda we're going to do um some uh some meat so we're gonna go to town first, uh, buy some meat, then uh, come to uh, Carrefour. Carrefour seems to have uh, lower prices, so we're going to go to Carrefour and do that as well. Then uh, after that, now I'll show you maybe the things that I have uh, bought. So yeah, stay tuned. Uh, yeah, let's go on this journey. We normally go to city market, um, some minced meat. Uh, we ask them to prepack it for us because it's easier to, you know, um, make. So they pack this into four. Uh, a kg was going for about 500 shillings. So we got um, about two kgs of minced meat. And then we also got some chicken. So this is minced meat as well. Minced meat. Minced meat. Then we also got some drumsticks. A kg was going for 600 shillings. So we got uh, one kg. And like I said, we asked them to pre-pack it for us. So this is just one of the packets. So this is 500 grams. And this is the second one. And then we also got some steak cubes. Um, beef was going for 600 shillings as well, which is essentially $6. So yeah, asked them to pre-pack it for us. They cut it for us nicely. Uh, then they pre-packed it and we have um, two of these and uh, yeah so that's the meat then the next stop was going to Kapo to do the grocery shopping we bought some uh, eggs we are also that is a, a lot of eggs so yeah the 12th one and uh, the crate of 30 we got some tissue velvet the tissue of choice Got two of them. We also got some peanuts. Got some milk. We got about, I think, six of them, if I'm not mistaken. We also got some bananas. Kapo had some really nice bananas, so yeah, we got some bananas as well. Some uh, sukuma wiki and a batch of um, 
spinach. The sukuma wiki was really um, fresh. We also got some tomatoes and 2 kg of onion. We got some fabric softener. I feel like if you get this one, you get more value for it. This is a five liters. It goes for like a thousand shillings. So I feel like you stay with it for longer. So fabric softener, some bread, some Korean uh, noodles. These ones are really, really tasty. We got some grapes as well. These ones are actually on special. They're going for like 200 shillings. Some frozen veg. Uh, sadly, today I wasn't able to go to the market to get the cheaper ones. So given that I needed to do a bit of cooking, just took the frozen veg so that at least the meals can still be uh, healthy, given that it's batch cooking. Um, some cheese. Uh, I really like this brand. Huh? And I remember when they were still starting out, their prices were really reasonable. Now their prices are really up. But um, no frills, this is some good cheese. They even have um, the feta cheese. Um, yeah, so you can try this brand. These are also sausages. We got these as well. We also got some chicken burgers. Uh, I want to make us some burgers. Actually, after this video, I want to make us some burgers. So we are really, really looking forward to that. So chicken burgers. This is some peanut butter. We like the Carrefour one. It's called Eva peanut butter. Um, feel like it, it seems like they are less um, it's it's um it's more it's not as processed as the other ones so this is uh really good uh batch cooking for the week i'm also going to make some uh, pancakes for the week for breakfast so yeah i got the pancakes mix i don't have much time this weekend to be doing things from scratch so at least i have the pancake mix to make things a bit easier also got some pasta. This is the 700 grams one. I think this will take you a, a while to finish. Um, it was actually on uh, special from I think 240 to 199. So yeah, I got uh, three of these. Five kg rice. I uh, really like this rice. No frills at all. Also got Jogo the five kgs. This is maize meal to make ugali slash uh, yeah <laughs> also got uh, this uh, tissue this is uh, kitchen towels so yeah really like to use them for me they're multi-purpose I even use them on my face when I have had a shower in the morning because I feel like most of the times when I use towels I break out so at least with this one one use you throw it away so yeah then also kitchen towel you use it for your kitchen use so love these had to get another bottle for me to put the oil because sadly um, the bottle that I had before was thrown away Okay, long story so yeah, I had to get a invest in a new one I'll just clean this up and then at least use this for now so I told you guys that I'll give you a review on these really good buy them I recommend you to buy them really 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 good so i got two of them they'll be pricey though 100 shillings so 200 shillings for both so try them not so bad and they are gentle on your pots etc they they might look like they're not but they are also got a uh, toothpaste no frills at all domestos has not been there in the market so far but at least topic is is really good especially this one the forest jew it really has a good smell so i bought the forest jew again i'm going to try the tropical blossom so i will let you know in the next time in the next uh installment whether i have uh liked this one more or i'm still on to the forest jew so try these really really good they are also just like uh domestos in my view they're a very close substitute also got the bowls for the the ones that you put in the toilet. What are they called? Yeah, the toilet cleaners that you put. Yeah, and then they color your water. So there was no blue. I really like the blue one. There was the pine one. It's still okay. Um, so Hapik is also good as well. I really, really like Hapik. Try it. It lasts you for a longer time if you compare to the other brands in the market. This time I only bought two coconut uh, creams um, and that's because I've been enjoying the chicken stock powder that I showed you guys the last time. It really, really does enhance the flavors. 
um, yeah try that one I know it was a bit pricey it was like 800 shillings or so let me just show you show you again it was this one try it really really good really 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 good so given that I've been enjoying the flavors I only got uh, two of these um, yeah because I'm still a coconut cream girl then I got this one as well it is the happy power plus this one is the one that you yeah toilet cleaner and then I also got this one the bathroom cleaner for sinks etc so together as a pack you would save more and it was like 775 shillings this one alone is going for like 640 shillings so I felt like it was a good um, package gosh and then I got this I have to sadly because I've used it the first time I enjoyed it and now I feel like I need it in my life but it's expensive it's like the price has gone back to 1800 so you essentially buy this for like 2k so how I'm going to be going about things I'm going to be very careful as to when I'm going to use this because it's really really pricey so this time I tried the deep clean technology one the green one and uh, we'll see the last time I think I showed you the lavender one that one is also good so I'll try this one and then see whether there's a difference or not um, yeah so I think that is everything we bought in this uh, haul um, yeah I feel like the, ch the kitchen is now full of so many things like so many things thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this uh, shopping vlogs let me know what you'd like to see from me in the next installment uh, nowadays I'm trying to say installment I feel like it is uh, neat <laughs> so yeah let me know what you want to see in the next installment thank you guys so much for supporting me thank you guys for clicking and watching my video hopefully you've watched the whole video and you're subscribed if you haven't please subscribe to my channel I'll really really appreciate you my name is Tinashe by the way so yeah thank you guys so much for watching I really appreciate you bye